And today is a really quick little video about... Ow, this ripped my hair out. It's because of the design, there's the base isn't bouncing around in your ear thing. Hey everyone, today's a really quick little video about my new headset. Headphones that I'll use for gaming, so they become a headset. These. So I've been using Razer Krakens for a couple of years now and they're really cute, but they're just not the headset for me. This could be a super niche video that doesn't appeal to many people, but I know I looked for it online and so I'm hoping that if somebody else looks for it, maybe this can help them out a little bit. I suffer pretty badly from anxiety and I also have a lot of hearing damage from too much loud music as a teenager. So I found that I've been struggling a lot when it comes to shooters, say like Call of Duty. It's hard for me to describe and it's already such an intense game, but I found that when I was playing and there were shots and explosions all around me, and I couldn't hear my own voice naturally when I was talking or my own actual surroundings. I was getting an intense feeling of fear and claustrophobia. I would get short of breath, overwhelmed by all the sound, and I couldn't concentrate. And eventually I'd just have to stop playing before I had a panic attack. So I started to look into what I could do to be able to hear myself speak, and that's when I discovered open back headphones. I'm not gonna get technical about it, but most gaming headsets are closed back. They're designed to really focus in your sound by blocking everything else out and also stop any sound leakage from going into the mic, which is sitting there next to the two giant speakers on your ears. Whether open back headphones have a perforated shell, so the air and sound can travel in and out freely, giving you a more natural experience and soundscape, and also meaning that you can hear yourself speak clearly and whatever is around you. I did a lot of research and ended up going with the Sennheiser HD58X Jubilee from Massdrop. I'll put the link below in the description. Depending on your budget, these are pretty reasonably priced for a good set of headphones, especially compared to a lot of open backs out there. And I thought it would be a good entry point for me to try out a new style. So far I have to say I'm really happy with them. They look great, black and gray, you can't really go wrong with that. They sit nice and close to my head, which is good because a lot of gaming headsets, they stick so far out, you end up looking like freaking Princess Leia or something with a bagel either side of your head. I've been using them for a few days now for gaming and music. I was expecting the music to have a lot more treble, be heavier on the treble, less so on the bass because open backs are known for not having great bass just because of their design. But these ones seem really balanced to me. I'm really sensitive to treble sounds because of my hearing damage and so far I haven't had any stabbing brain pains from the trebles piercing my ear holes. I did see a video that said the HD58Xs were tuned a bit lower than most, not quite as heavy on the treble, which was another reason I ended up going with these ones. I've listened to a variety of music, I've listened to metal, EDM, hip hop, a bit of classical even, and all of them have been sounding great. And compared to my Bose wireless ones, which are my main music ones, the Bose ones are definitely heavier in the bass, but not everything needs to be drowned in bass all the time. Although I do like bass. For gaming, I've only used them while playing Call of Duty so far, but I've been having such a good time with them. I haven't been feeling blocked in or deafened or exhausted by the sounds, but everything is really clear. A lot of people when talking about open back headphones will talk about sound stages and how big or small or wide or whatever they are. I haven't quite wrapped my head around that, but I have been able to hear footsteps better, I've been able to sense direction and distance better, and I've been able to hear myself talk clearly. Oh, shite. Dumbass. That might sound strange to most gamers, but I can't stand the feeling of being blocked in by noise cancelling or closed back headsets. I like to be able to hear my voice clearly and with these so far I have been able to. I can hear my surroundings, it doesn't feel like I have my fingers in my ears and say if the doorbell rings, I know I can hear it and just know to ignore it because I don't like answering my door. Why are you at my door? I don't trust you. That might be rude. There is a downside, of course. There isn't a mic. These are headphones, they aren't a headset. Um, so far, I've just been using one of my filming mics attached to my shirt, and it's been great. It hasn't been picking up sound leakage from the headset, and it hasn't been picking up my keyboard, which is a clicky one. Literally the worst thing ever. Don't ever buy a clicky one. It's the next thing to be upgraded, but the mic hasn't been picking up that, so that's good. I'll probably end up getting a mod mic, which is like a gaming mic that you put on with some 3M tape, and everything becomes an instant headset. 
Also, another thing, if you're playing around other people, they will be able to hear what you hear. Also, if they're noisy, you'll be able to hear them. Their open back sounds go in, sounds go out. That's fine for me. I don't mind. I like hearing my surroundings, but everybody is different. So keep that in mind. Don't watch anything that you shouldn't be watching in public. Anyway, that's it, short and sweet. I'm gonna keep using them for gaming. I am gonna keep using them for music when I'm at my PC. I've found so far they've been helping with my anxiety. Uh, they've been helping me hear more within the games and they've also been gentle on my damaged little sensitive ears. If you found this helpful or you have a recommendation of your own, please comment below. Also like and subscribe while you're there, all that good stuff. And thank you for watching. I really hope this was useful to you and I will see you in my next video. Jump to the face. It's actually more of a tip to the face. Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Call of Duty. Call of Duty Modern Warfare.